Hello everyone, welcome to another video tutorial. Today we're going to be talking about how to use the if function and the and function together. In this example, we have a list of suppliers, the volume that they purchase for, uh, the associated region, and the associated cost. And in column E, I want to uh, calculate the rebate based off of if they're in the North American region and if their volume is over 400,000. To do this, we're going to go into cell E2 and we're going to type in equals IF. Tab to open that up. And just like any standard if function, it's going to ask us for a logical test. And then it's going to say if it passes that logical test, uh, apply this logic. If it fails the logical test, then uh, uh, apply the CERN logic, right? So what happens if I have multiple things that I want to test for? I'm going to go ahead and use the AND function, okay? So we see in the AND function, it gives us the opportunity to pass in a bunch of logical tests, right? And the first one being is I want to test the region. So I'm going to say C2 equals North America. So it's, it's as if I'm saying if uh, the region equals North America, then go ahead and continue. But I also want to do another logical test. So I'm going to do a comma and I'm going to pass in if B2 happens to be greater than 400,000. I'm going to caution you here when you're using numbers do not use a comma because if I were to use a comma right now, it's as if I'm going into the logical test three and I do not want to do that. So remove that comma and type in 400,000. And these are the only two things that I want to test for in this example. So I'm going to go ahead and close off the and function and we can see we're back in the if function. So add a comma to go into the if value is true. So if it passes our test here, then what I want to do is take the cost, which is D2, and multiply that by 0.5, okay? If it fails our test, then we're going to take D2 and multiply by 0.1. We're going to close off the if function with a closing parenthesis, and we can just drag this formula down, and we can see for Apple, our volume is over 400,000, and our region is North America, so it took the cost, and it multiplied by 0.5, so 50%. We can see for Acer, our volume is less than 400,000 and our region is Asia Pacific. So therefore it takes the cost and it multiplies by 0.1, so 10%. That's how you do if and, uh, and functions together. Thank you for watching.